What's up, YouTube? Back with another Empire South project. Today, we're gonna mess with what's called traction bars. Now, uh, a lot of you might not be familiar with what traction bars are, but here's the rundown. This is what actually, this is what this video is about. I'm just gonna tell you how it works. Uh, the it's it's kind of it's something to alleviate some of the negative effects that a lift kit puts on your truck. So let me start from the beginning. My truck has a six and a half inch lift on it. And it also carries around about 2,000 to 2,500 pounds of weight on the back. Now, what that does is yes, you've got a diesel truck and it's super powerful and everything, but it weighs a lot. Now. There's, there's a bunch of scientific formulas and stuff I won't go into, but the way it works is your truck's heavy, your engine's powerful, so in order to get it moving, you have to, uh, it puts a lot of strain on any kind of weak parts that you have. So here's what, here's the way it works. When your truck's real heavy, when your truck, let me back up, when your truck's not heavy, what happens is, this is your axle, this is your drive shaft. Now, we'll say a lifted truck looks like this. So, what happens is, whenever you have everything right and together, and you're set up to drag race and all that, when your axle starts to turn, your drive shaft stays straight. But, whenever you have a lot of weight pushing down on your bed, what happens is, whenever you go to take off, your wheels want to turn, but the weak link which is your springs makes your axle roll and your drive it puts a really negative angle on your drive shaft just like that now when you hit your brakes same thing it twists those uh it twists those leaf springs rolls it down now, this is what's called axle wrap now the way a traction bar works the traction bar you have your axle just say this is your wheel your axle this would be the traction bar. Now what will happen is you connect this end to your frame and this end goes right underneath your axle. And that's, it's a leverage control, if you will. So what happens is your drive shaft will be up here. So instead of taking off and your axle twisting up, the traction bar will catch it and help keep everything centered. Now what that's gonna do is that's gonna help with braking, that's gonna help with acceleration. Uh, on a truck this tall, whenever you hit a big huge bump, it's gonna keep it from, from flexing and bouncing and, and a bunch of rattling and shaking and, and all that stuff. Now the negative effects, keep this in mind too because you can't trade one for the other. What happens is now your weakest link is no longer your leaf springs, where you get your roll roll from. Your weakest link becomes your pinion, your ring and pinion gear inside your axle. And for those of you that don't know what that is, your drive shaft comes into your axle and you have what's called a pinion gear. Now the pinion gear turns and now next to that, you have a ring gear. Now whenever your drive shaft, whenever your Whenever your motor turns your drive shaft, it turns your pinion. And whenever your pinion turns, it turns your ring gear. And then what your ring gear does is turns your actual shaft, which turns your wheels and blah, 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 so forth, so forth. That becomes your weakest link. So it's, yeah, it's gonna be stronger than your leaf springs and your leaf strings didn't break. But once you go to throwing programmers and turbos and juicing this and nitrous and cold air and blah, 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 that's when you're going to run into problems. So, this is a fix for your ride quality, steering, braking, acceleration. Now, I'm not saying that you're going to break your ring and pinion, you're not going to break your drive shaft, but I just want you to know it could happen. So, uh... So this is a claimer. You give this to the Cody Empire South, not to be, not to be copyrighted Empire South Inc. Okay. So uh, anyway, 
I'm gonna end this video because it's super short and judging by the way you guys watch the videos, you like super short because you don't watch all the videos. And that's okay too, that's my problem. I need to fix that. So uh, anyway, I got all my stuff together. I'm fixing to build some traction bars. I'm gonna take some footage. I'm gonna try to keep it short and sweet. And yeah. So anyway, next couple videos are gonna be traction bar. Uh, if you want to get updated, if you're not if if you're not on my on my Facebook or Instagram or any of that, if you'll subscribe to the channel, the uh, you'll get updates and you'll know when it's coming. So if you're interested, then make sure and subscribe, make sure and like, make sure and go try to follow Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat, the whole deal. Uh, What's the other the other thing? Um, can't remember. Maybe I'll catch it on the next video. Anyway, I hope you like it. If you like it, like it. And make sure and share. If you know anybody that is into suspension and doesn't really know how it works or you think it might be useful, make sure and tell them. Tell them subscribe. And they'll get all the updates. And uh, anyway, so look. See y'all in the next video. Thank you.